By the time you finish watching this episode, our YouTube account will probably be taken down. See ya! Hey, you! what's the big idea just walking out in the middle of my door with Kaiba? I'm sorry, Joey. I had to deal with a very annoying subplot. What did I miss? Oh, uh, well, I, I totally beat him. Yeah, I was, uh, I beat the guy. I beat Kaiba. Uh, that's what happened. Really? How did you overcome his various dragon-themed stratagems? Uh, time will let go. Nice. That's what I would have done, too. Yeah. Yes, you must be so proud of beating Kaiba and winning the coveted bronze medal. <laughs> oh, that never gets old. <laughs> I'm proud of you for winning, Joey. You're my hero. Get the f up, Tristan. Bronze medal. Oh, that's funny. What's up, Fodamuckers? Pharaoh, I'm going to enjoy crushing you. And I'm going to enjoy beating you in a trading card game, thereby preventing you from doing anything evil ever again. This from the guy who had slaves built in his very own pyramid. That was a birthday gift from me to me. And besides, my slaves were treated extremely well. Only half of them died from excess whipping. The rest died from overexposure. I was a very merciful guy. Trust me, I won't be. Yugi, use this card to defeat Merrick. Ha! Do you have to throw them like that? Really? Yes! Oh, yes, Kaiba. I see what you mean. I will definitely be able to defeat Merrick with this card. Nice, I'm going to win. I'm going to win with the card that Kaiba gave me. Yes! <laughs> I mean, um, this card is lame. A lame card. Why would you give me such a lame card, Kaiba? What were you thinking? What's such a lame idea? You lame-o. Stupid. Stupid lame-o. Kaiba, I think he's buying it. You have such a good poker face, Yugi. Yes, I do. What's poker? It's what I'll be running into your lower intestines when I'm done with you in this ultimate card game, Pharaoh. Okay. Ew. <laughs> I don't even need to look at my cards while I shuffle them, Fado. Neither do I, Maddock. I'm so good at this. And you dropped a few cards. No, I didn't. I'm extremely competent. Yes. Look at my nimble fingers. You should probably watch what you're doing. King of games, bitch. Once you were the king of games, now you'll eat humble pie. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Thank you, Kaiba. For what? Giving the Pharaoh your card was an incredible display of faith. You finally believe he is destined to defeat my brother. I believe that about as much as I believe that there is a minimum wage for my employees. Look, Ishizu, Yugi is no Pharaoh. I can't allow myself to accept that. Why? Because you don't believe in magic? No. I just don't believe in people who are richer and more powerful than me. Beat that Merrick creep, Yug! Yeah! Beat him like Joey beat Kaiba! What? Nothing! Swiggity Swaggo Realm! Say hello to the Shadow Realm! <laughs> You know, it's really more of a purple realm than a shadow realm. Since I'm about to end you, Pharaoh. Shadows aren't really known for being purple. Silence! I'm just saying. I think it's only appropriate that I remind you what you're fighting for. Say hello to my Valentine. <coughs> hello, my. <coughs> Bye, my. And now meet my next victim. Your very own hetero life mate. Yugi Moto! Yugi, you have your own body! Merrick must be using fanfic powers! He truly is our most evil adversary! Adversary? Advers... Advers... He... He's a dick! My weaker self is also at stake in this duel! Uh, no, Bacara, don't eat your spaghetti with your mouth open, it gets everywhere! Told you not to do that. If one of us loses, we'll be sacrificing our other halves to the Shadow Realm. Purple Realm. Silence! I'm just saying. Then try this on for size. Vampiric Leech. Attack the Pharaoh directly. Ah! My leg! My ballet career is ruined! Stop being so adversarial, Merrick. Adversarial. Adver... Adversary. Stop being a dick, Merrick! With every life point you lose, your partner suffers! I don't believe you! What? You're trying to psych me out, Merrick, but it won't work! You're a gay girl! Queen's Knight! Oh god, 
my arm! My ping pong career is ruined! I think I would know if Yugi was in pain. I am in so much pain! I feel everything he feels. We are soulmates. I can feel my soul wasting away! We are closer than even the most intimate of lovers. I want a divorce! <laughs> I promised you pinatas, fellow. Now, let's see how many times I have to strike yours before delicious candy falls out. Blah! Is the tongue thing really necessary? I'm your boyfriend now, Nancy. <laughs> Jeez, you're like an evil Gene Simmons. Correction, you're like Gene Simmons. Prepare for your destruction, Pharaoh. I have a name, you know. Really? What is it? I don't know. I know exactly what Marek's doing. He's setting Yugi up so that he can summon his winged dragon of Ra. It's the same strategy that he used in his duel with me, only this time I don't know I don't know, know what Marek's to... up to, but he won't be able to stop me once I've summoned Slifer the- Wait, who is that? Kaiba! Is that you? Yeah, I was just in the middle of an inner monologue. Oh, you have those too! All the time. What do you think I'm doing when we're dueling and I'm just standing there not talking for like ten minutes? I always just assumed you were really slow. Look, just try not to interrupt my inner monologue. I don't know future. what Merrick's up to, but what I do know is that I'm really hungry and I could go for some french fried potatoes, maybe some hot dogs, some mustard, and- Tristan! What? Wait, Wait your, your turn. turn. We're, We're inner monologuing. Oh, you guys do that too? Yes. I always thought you were just really slow. Now watch as I unleash my great beast, the Winged Dragon of Ra! What's that, Ferro? You give up because you have no chance against my god card? I didn't say that. What's that? I'm much better at this game than you ever were? I would never say that or think it. And you're going to pull down your pants and let me spank you when I've won? How are you even getting that from what I'm saying? Are you drunk? Because that's the only way it would sound like I'm saying those things. Either that or you're crazy. Oh, that's right. I forgot who I was dueling for a second. I now sacrifice all but one of my life points to merge with Ra, raising its attack points. Now all you can do is watch as you and your partner are banished to the Shadow Realm. Purple Realm. Silence! I'm just saying. Honestly, you are this close to being thrown to the shadows. You mean thrown to the purples. Silence! I'm just saying. Pharaoh, you have to draw the card that Kaiba gave you. But how, Yugi? The odds of me doing that are like a billion to one. Believe in the heart of the cards. The heart of the what? The heart of the cards. Doesn't ring a bell. We've been talking about it for three seasons. Oh, okay. Uh, what does it look like? What? I need to picture it in my head. Is it an actual heart? No, it's not a literal heart. It's more of an idea. Sorry, Yugi. I'm from ancient Egypt. We believe in very specific real-life things, like giant red dragons with two mouths, or the idea that a strange dog person waits for us in the afterlife so that he can weigh our souls with a cheap kitchen scale. You know, believable things. Look, you'll probably just draw the card anyway. Give it a shot. Behold! The card that Kaiba gave me! Fiend Sanctuary! Uh, impossible! You drew the card without even looking at it? Yes! What? Kiss! Is that... You say yes? Kiss! It, it sounds like you're just saying kiss! No, Merrick, I am saying kiss! Are you trying to make it sound more dramatic or something by slurring your words? Because it doesn't really work. Not so fast, Merrick. You're not even speaking English at this point! And now watch as I summon my metal fiend to force your winged dragon of Ra to attack you instead of me! No! Yes! No! Yes! Now, what? I used my diffusion magic card to separate myself from Ra, thus cancelling my attack. Heart of the cards? More like heart of my ass. I don't think I want to believe in that. Now, I sacrifice my metal fiends to summon Obelisk the Tormentor, the card that I won from Kaiba. Thanks for not being butthurt about that, by the way. F*** you. You're welcome. Wait, uh, hold on a second. Uh, let's play something else. How about rock, paper, scissors? Okay, I choose rock. What do you choose, Merrick? Um... Sorry, rock beats on. Are you having fun yet, Merrick? Oh, believe me, Pharaoh. I haven't even begun to enjoy myself. Oh, goody. Now my metal reflect slime will make an exact replica of your obelisk, the Tormentor. No way! Where did you get a shiny obelisk? Did you catch that from my friend Safari? No, I... 
You, you just, just saw me use my metal reflect flying. We should trade. Let's trade. I just gave you that card. Don't fucking trade it. I'ma trade it. No. Now all you can do is wait for me to re-summon my winged dragon of Ra, and then this game is over. I'll throw in a fiend sanctuary for that shiny obelisk. Don't you dare trade my fiend sanctuary. I'ma trade it. No. Everybody, shut the fuck up and be intimidated by me. I'm scared. Great, look what you did. You scared Tristan. Are you happy? Yes, I'm very fucking happy. I'm the hap hap happiest kid in the world. I feel like I'm in fucking Legoland right now. Whoop de fucking do. I could just explode with happiness. That's just how fucking happy I am. You don't look very happy. Ah! What's up, oh bro? It's me, Maddock. Since I'm about to die, I thought I'd come tell you, uh... You were the greatest brother I've ever had. And you weren't such a bad henchman, either. Is there anything you want to say to me? Maybe along those lines? Maybe something like, Maddock, you are the finest man I've ever known. You are the sexiest villain of all time. And I will always admire you, and do your bidding even in death. You know, something like that, only... More of that. Good talk, Odeon. Oh, by the way, I left some gummy bears in my room. Gummy bears! Have you guys ever noticed that Yugi starts acting like a different person when he duels? That's because he is a different His person. His voice gets all deep and he seems to grow taller. That's because he's a different person. It's really weird. You're really weird. I guess we'll never really know why that happens. Hello. Behold my victory! At long last I will have justice! And the Tomb Keeper lineage will be avenged! You know, Marek, it's okay to be a giant bitch, but you don't have to be such a giant bitch about it! Master Marek! Odeon! 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 Master Marek! Marek! Fado! Master Marek! Odeon! Marek! Fado! Seto! Yugi! Master Marek! Tristan! Rocker! It's over, Merrick! I activate Ragnarok! Now the spirits of all the monsters in my deck will combine to defeat your Egyptian god! So prepare yourself, Merrick, for the biggest bear hug of your life! No! No! I know I said I wanted a hug, but I didn't mean it like this! Can you destroyed Merrick's god card! That means that Merrick's evil half is gone too! Have you guys ever noticed that Yugi seems different when he duels? It's so weird! What? What is the meaning of this? I spy with my little eye something beginning with what the f***? No! 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 Surprise, bitch! I bet you thought you'd seen the last of me! No! It's funny because it's from the internet. Spooky, scary skeletons and shivers down your spine. Shrieking skulls will shock your soul, seal your doom tonight. Jeez, Bacotta, close your mouth, you're getting spaghetti everywhere. Uh, didn't your mother ever teach you how to eat? Oh, she died? Probably from embarrassment because you can't eat frigging spaghetti.